Hello and welcome to another edition of What Dinosaurs Are Useful. Today we're going to look at the Stegosaurus. Stegosauruses, they're pretty damn slow. But they're pretty damn useful too. I would consider this the mid-tier of berry collecting. Definitely a must-have for any base or uh, uh, settlement, so to speak. Very, very useful as they do collect a lot of berries and thatch very quickly. They eat like 27 narco berries in one swing. Another 15. I mean, who can't complain about getting that many narco berries in just a couple tail swings? Their stamina is not the best. I mean, this is him sprinting, and so he's not going to be going anywhere fast. There you go. Another 42 narco berries. 49. A bunch of other berries to keep you thus sated and the rest of your dinosaur army very fed, as long as they're herbivores. And, uh, you know, just very good and useful for collecting lots of berries. Definitely something you need to do, especially when taming. You just go out, collect these, then get the spoiled meats off of everything else. And see, I've even encumbered myself. Oh, I just ran out of stamina. So, Stegosaurus is very useful. Berry collectors, decent base defense. I mean, they can handle themselves against some several things. Uh, I don't. You wouldn't want to get them as your primary defense. Obviously, you want to have something like a T-Rex or some or raptors, sabers, something like that. But... As a gatherer of berries in which you need to make narcotics, these guys are essential. Pretty much it. Not really a whole lot to talk about. I mean, they're pretty slow. So, you want to make sure that wherever you have said base, it is nearby uh, berries. And this guy's like stuck in this stupid tree. I hate it when this happens. Now the tree is gone. But, if you ever have that problem, just swing your tail until it stops. So, as you see, you know, just kind of, I have a little path here, we just kind of walk back and forth and collect the berries that are necessary. Then we go back and unload. Of course, if you don't feel like waiting for him, he will, of course, go at, like, sprinting level speeds when you get off of him and run, once he decides that he wants to follow. Sometimes he will get stuck, but as you see, there he comes. He just kind of starts sprinting, and he'll make it back here. So I can just come over here and sit and wait. Instead of trying to steer him. Of course, he's going to get stuck on that little ledge and make me a liar. But he'll make it over eventually. And so, in a quick... What was that? Maybe a whole minute I spent out there. We got ourselves... I'd say at least 100 narco berries. Because we got 271 narco berries on us right now. I'm sure some of that's old. But, super useful. Very, very, very useful. That's all I can say. They're great for getting narcotics. So if you want to start training a lot of other dinosaurs, getting a Stegosaurus early is very good because he will just keep you fed up on the narcotics because you want to get this and spoiled meat. So get a raptor and a Stegosaurus or a saber tooth and a Stegosaurus and you will be good on spoiled meat as well as berries. So, of course, you guys aren't super useful up in the mountains because there aren't a whole lot of berries to collect. Thank you very much, and tune in for another episode of What Dinosaurs Are Useful. There's a Rex, boys! Fight it! Holy shit! Fuck you! Fight it! Fuck the PP! Fight it! This level fucking seven bullshit! He's eating the trike! He's stealing our meat, that son of a bitch! Fuck him!